didn't occur to me that, you know, rock and roll ever had a life that long. You know? Well, nobody at that particular time really thought it would become something. Um, myself and my contemporaries at my age, uh, I guess it's all new ground to us, you know, we're just learning what to do with it at this age and still playing rock and roll. Because we're the first bunch that have gotten that far along. You know? I struggle to understand how I'm no longer 20. I don't know. I don't know anybody else this has ever happened to. It's a struggle to understand how I'm no longer 20. I don't know. I don't know anybody else this has ever happened to. As you get older, I think you, you find less and less it's important, apart, apart from some very fundamental things. Uh, one of them being a love of one's fellow man, and uh, a care for their survival, and a care for one's immediate family, then friends. I struggle to understand how I'm no longer 20. I don't know. I don't know anybody else this has ever happened to. It's a struggle to understand how I'm no longer 20. I don't know. I don't know anybody else this has ever happened to. It's 
a struggle to understand how I'm no longer 20. I don't know. I don't know anybody else this has ever happened to. It's for selfish reasons as much as anything else. It's to keep us interested, you know. Because I think if the if the uh, artist's interest goes on, it, it it plays to the audience that way. And uh, you don't want to go and see an artist who looks bored stiff as what he's doing. Don't go and see an artist who looks bored stiff as what he's doing. Don't go and see an artist who looks bored stiff as what he's doing.